I must admit, I spent a long time in my life trying to work out whether I thought wind farms were beautiful or ugly. But you'll be relieved to know, as a 51% shareholder of Meridian, I've come down on the side of beautiful, okay? Well, you must have been 94, I think, and I've got an idea that wind farming could be a potential, you know, for the future. And, um... and then, so we gradually narrowed it down to Meridian, I guess, because by then they'd They'd done Tiapiti, they had a bit more experience in it, and, and to be honest, they were actually e easy to deal with. From when they start, when they put those bulldozers in, it, it certainly is a shock, you know. As you can see, you know, you come off our farm track and it's like you're living in Lilliput and you go to Gulliver's World. The performance and the delivery of this project has been has been outstanding. There's been some big challenges in terms of the roading, the civils, you know, forestry, all of that stuff put together, plus standing up the turbines. The challenges don't stop coming. You do it on the count of three. Okay, one, two, three. I feel like a, um, I feel like a miracle. Like a dream came true. My son was up here the other day and he said, gee, that, that's a great that's a great sight. He said, you've got technology and farming all hand in hand, you know. That's the way they see it, you know, and that's that's pretty cool, I reckon. The thing I'm most proud of is we've had 1,300 people inducted into this project. We've worked over 300,000 man hours and we've yet to have any significant injuries and I think the culture amongst our contractors and our own staff has been superb from a health and safety perspective and that's what we in Meridian hold most dearly.